when I hit 2K, man. I mean... <laughs> you guys are crazy. All right, let's continue the campaign. So, I mean, options. Let me think. I can do a longer stream. I might do... You know what? I haven't done a giveaway in a while. I might... I might. If I had 2K, I might do a giveaway. Yeah, I'm thinking about that. That'd be dope. But, like, subs, get, get, do a sub giveaway. Hmm... I could do a long stream. Hmm, I, I don't know. I don't know. I guess I guess it's just gonna when it comes to me, it'll come to me. And let's go. I mean let me get let me get prepared. I wonder, should I move my camera like up here in this area? Let me see. Let me see. I am kind of blocking some of the screen. Where can I put it? Hold on. Merc! 96 hours, Sheen. What the fuck? I look like streaming for 96 hours. What kind of animal you think I am? This, uh, it was bad enough I tried to do the 24-hour stream. Not gonna lie, if you hit 2K, I'll I'll drop I'll do a giveaway of my hands and make sure you win. <laughs> oh, friend, you too much, man. I swear to God. Why would you come here and demean him like that? Yeah, he won't consider anything less than two to 192 hours. Demean? What do you mean? Am I missing something? Iceman, thank you for lurking. Appreciate that. No demeaning. No demeaning. <laughs> yeah, the suggestion of a 96-hour uh, hour stream, that's not nearly enough hours. Listen. If you guys really want me to do a long ass stream like that, I'm gonna need like, I'm gonna need some like real good incentives. <laughs> you motherfuckers have to be with here with me. I ain't gonna just be streaming by myself. What I what I, what I look like? <laughs> what I look like doing that? But you know what? I might I will do a long stream. I I will do it. Um, maybe maybe I'll try to do a twelve hour. I did twenty. I think the longest I've done is. Uh, 20 hours. Oh, fuck. The music is the, the sound slow. Let me turn that up a little bit. I forget that when I'm streaming, when I, when I start my stream, I have the music so low, and then... I forget to turn it back up. <laughs> Shit. Oh, fuck. I picked that up. Oh my god, just pick up the try shot, please. God shit, I'm hurt! Rip my life. Somebody pick me up, Del. Del. Oh, yeah, I'm good to go. Thanks, Del. I might just pick this up. Alright, that's how you do it. <laughs> Alright, what I miss? Uh why would 192 hours truly suffice? 240 is the magic number. Oh my god. Wait, so how long how many days is 240? Thinking about it, hold on, let me see. 240 divided by 24. 10 days! What the fuck? Listen. 
Twitch is not my job yet. <laughs> I can't do 10 days. <laughs> 500 hours would be nice. 500. That's tw that's double. That's tw 21 days. Nah, bro. Okay, now we're getting absurd. <laughs> nah, bro. We, like, flight talking about... <laughs> Tatum site. That's funny. It's going to be the sex number, the pot number, or the spooky number. Otherwise, you're not memeing. <laughs> oh, man. You, you make a good point. <laughs> you guys are insane. I don't see... What benefit do I get from staying up streaming that long? Isn't it known for people to like, like, have you the streamers that actually died for streaming long periods of time? Maybe I'm not like, I'm, like sitting in a chair for long periods of time. Like, if I could bring you guys with me to other places, I would totally do that. Like, do like a in real live stream. But I don't want to show you guys too much because I know you, you, some of you guys are weird. <laughs> you guys might actually stalk me, so I'm good. <laughs> But you know what would be sick? I wanna I wanna keep doing what I'm doing and keep streaming to the point where I get to like, whenever they have Twitch time, I can be a part of that. And then I get to hopefully meet one of some of you guys. I said one of you guys, like, some of you guys. I mean it's already it's already in the works of me and Paul Grandfather. I'm gonna I'm gonna facilitate it. I'm gonna get a, a flag pool game for, for streamers. Up and comer entertainers. I'm, I'm telling you, that would be so dope. Or, or dodgeball. That would be sick. A uh, uh, a stream of dodgeball with streamers. Post COVID. <laughs> Madhead gamer coming to say good night and much love. Have a beautiful night. Thank you so much for hanging out with your boy. Appreciate that. Uh, you would go viral by the t a thousand hour, of course. See. I don't know if I would go viral. There's there's a lot of streamers that do that stuff, and it's not really worth it. They like some of them get sick. I'm not trying to get sick. I'm pretty sure he'd go viral for on uh, a 96 hour. That shit must be harder than I, I struggled. To, listen, I, I could have done the 24 hours, but I I had to get my hair dyed, and I don't want to like trying to operate a vehicle. Uh, no sleep is probably the worst idea. Yeah, there, Driving an hour. Let's find like, that office. What I don't is a know, commander's office even look I can like? see why people do it, like if it's their door, job. Nameplate, like if people want to do like 96 hours, 200, like do a long stream, response. then their their main thing is Twitch, you know. And I'm trying to make Twitch my main thing, so I'm not saying no now. I am saying no now. <laughs> but in the future, you never know. We'll see where I'm at. Like I've only, like I said, I've been only streaming for six months, Amanda's and to be where here. I'm at, I'm just very the grateful for it. Um, so we'll see, we'll see. And and especially once I like once I hit like the 18th, 19th hour, I start seeing shit. So I don't know what's reality or not. I don't know if I really, I, would, I don't know if it's healthy to look at a screen for that long. <laughs> uh, Pretty sure he'll go, uh, good night. <laughs> that shit would be harder than never mind. <laughs> this is Again, I attempted it. I attempted it, but I just I just don't think for health reasons it's it's a wise idea. And I don't need to I'm not I don't need to go viral. I'll I'll I'll, I'll, I'll make it my own at my own pace. You know? I could just put as much content on different platforms and just Look keep doing what I'm doing. Air duct or something. It's gotta be big enough for Dave. For Dave. Oh, look at that. Boom. Dave, go through Dave, that go, go, go do your job. So, Baird once lost data, huh? What does it even look like? So, I mean, my my, uh, my schedule will change, guys, starting in January uh, regarding streaming. I think I still want to try to do four days, but I might shoot to five and go from there. It's, I'm still trying to figure it out, but I know I changed it a lot, but... Things are changing. Every day, something's changing in my life. For the good, you know? And, I mean, obviously, some bad. But, one day at a time. But, again, I think... I have to thank you guys for... Right, commander's office. Let's just look being so wholesome. Except you off, because, you know, you're always trying to... Throw Safe. them hands. No, I'm just kidding. Secret data? <laughs> hey, 
Dave, get this open. I just, again, I just appreciate you guys so much. Gotcha. Thank hey, you, Dave. Hey, Control, good news. We found the data drive. Appreciate it, Delta. Hey, you know what we'd appreciate? Some backup. What? Where are you? The silo. We found it. And they're all right, over got, us. got you. That's oh, shit. We're on our way. Ooh, UIR Hammer of Dawn blueprints. And also, like, another thing is, I try to stream seven days a week, <clears throat> and I got burned out. Like, I didn't, I didn't, like, I, I don't ever want to feel like I don't want to stream. Because if I start doing that, it, it's here. a wrap. <laughs> I want to keep enjoying it, so, like, I think I'm going to do either four or five days a week. <clears throat> and plus, I can't put streaming over the wifey. <laughs> You might have, you might actually see me be a, a dead zombie, man. I know, I'm not trying to do that. You feel me? <laughs> oh, wrong button. All right, so we can get, let's go this way. Let's see what's over here. Shit, not this way. No, I know it's not this way. I want to look. I want to. I want to see. JD. I think that's his name. Nope, dead end. <laughs> nah, listen. I love my wife, but she can. She's scary. When she's she's upset, nah, not worth it, man. I, like I said, I love you guys, but I love her more. <laughs> Wait, what was that explosive round check? Oh, I hold this real quick. Hold oh, this. Shit. Hey, man, we leave you guys alone for five minutes. Hold yeah, it's grenade. goddamn hilarious. Just help us clear them out. <laughs> That's what I need. The answer. Nope, that's the wrong gun. He'll initiate the launch. Lancer ammo. Grenades. I need grenades and lancer ammo. Lancer. Lancer. Yes. Can you imagine somebody holding like 400 bullets on them? With a, like, that's a lot. Oh, lancer. Let's see. Anything else? Is this lancer? Oh, is this the lancer I had before? Yeah, this is. Yeah, and look, boom. More ammo. <laughs> Marcus, you know Jin pretty well. Just how angry is she gonna be with us launching this thing? So I'm thinking like, uh, should I make a schedule of what so games I should play or should I just keep doing what I'm doing and just play whatever I feel? Because I feel like okay. I, I enjoy that a little bit more because I like to be unpredictable. But I also want to let people know like if they want to watch a certain game, then I should let you guys know, right? <laughs> oh my god. It's all yours. Where, where, where's uh control Titan you're in. when I need Start him the to sequence. tell me to hydrate? Pressurized first stage, opening silo doors. Error, error. Uh, Delta, error. we have an issue. The silo hatch, it's not opening. Bared <coughs> <laughs> <laughs> options. Find I told. <laughs> Alright, then we call it. Let's go! Oh shit, wait, hold on. Was I able to change his voice into... Batista? Or is that later? Mature content. Profanity filter. Nah, we gotta make sure all that shit is good. I also th think I curse way too much. <laughs> so I might limit that. that. Open. You know? What? All the Can't fucking words I say that is. <laughs> Damn it, we came here to do this, so let's get it done. Ignition Literally, just, just say fuck it. I want to play this. That's what I've been doing. I've like, just been finding games that are just like 
want to try and like and have a date for the first time, so can I just play that? And sometimes I don't really like to finish games. <laughs> but that's that's part of my personality too. God damn it, James! I have got to learn to stop following you. Yeah, good luck with that. Let's get that hatch open. All right. Wait, so what's our I... plan? Shut up. Oh, I fuck. don't know. I think I could have played it. There's gotta be a manual override near the top. Find a way up. I don't know if that's an enemy or not. We gotta get across the gap. Give me that ammo. Give me that. No. No. Me... No. Not that. Fuck. Give me that ammo. And also, like, I'm not the greatest well, commentator when I play video games. I don't need to <laughs> Pause in the game is my best friend. The pause button? That's my next game. Like, damn, I can't wait until these things are good. I gotta do it. get my transition thing set up. I gotta get my emotes out of the way. Like, all of this stuff is I gotta get the, the New Year's Eve thing popping. We're making big moves, chat. Alright, which, which way I gotta go? Do I gotta go up? I gotta go up. Can I go this way? Oh shit, can we, can we tell him to put this down? Uh, how do we do that? What? Fire in the hole! Uh. Alright, he's dead. I think you can tell him to touch this. Hey, turn on that platform! Ignition, engine 2. That's not good! No! It's... it's not! Alright, it's gonna lower the platform now. When, when did the first gears come out? Platform's down! Let's go! Shit, another gap! The more I'm thinking about it, it's been... It's, it's, Ignition, this game, engine this, 3. This series has been out for so long, man. I can't even see anything right now. Bring it down, Dave! Come on, Dave. Uh, now, how many engines does a rocket have? Usually? I think I felt the reason why I fell into uh, love with the engineers is because the, the oh, board come board. on! I think it was the board board. Oh, the way it's just endless waves of enemies. God oh, damn it! It's jammed! We can get around! Let's go! Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go! But, like I said, I'm not known for my gameplay. I'm known for talking so fucking much. <laughs> huh? I'm gonna hear what's not your finest idea, man! That's right! Oh, he's down. Guess what? Oh. Give me that feeling. He's straight in his ass. Finish him. Here we go. Come on, fire. I actually think about playing Ghost of Shishima again because they have a new uh, downloadable content, am I right? <clears throat> Dead Space on Outlast next. I gotta play some horror again. Punch it! No! Dave's still out there! Who gives a shit? He's a robot! That's not his fault! One. Gotcha! Lift off. Ooh, the sound is way too loud. 
Turn that down, a scotch. We're shooting rockets up in space, chat. That's me. That's me next. I'm going up in this uh, the stratosphere. Unbelievable. <laughs> oh, the look of disappointment. Sam, we're ready for extraction. The evil look of satisfaction, uh, satisfaction, disappointment. Oh, did I get an achievement? Yes, sir, ski. Hope. I honestly didn't know what the fuck that said. Chaps? Champs? Champs? Like the shoe company? <laughs> Welcome back, kids. Oh, one thing. Ken found out about our little vacation to Hammerland, and as I predicted, she's not happy. Now that she's done yelling at me, she wants to yell at you. All of you. Roger that, Control. All right, let's do it. I'm ready to get screamed at for doing something that I wasn't supposed to do. Come on, time to face the music. I might actually cosplay as uh, one of the Gears people and put that shit on Reddit. Do that Reddit. Uh, TikTok? And Reddit? And Snapchat? And Instagram. James, how about I see Jen first? And the hub. Let me stop. <laughs> Calm the storm before you brief her. I'm sorry, is this Sergeant Phoenix oh, being neck. diplomatic? You can call it what you want, but we're at war, even if it doesn't feel like it yet. We all have to be on the same page. Yeah, well, I mean, if you think it'll help, then sure. Wish you'd have been this willing to listen back at that silo. Hey, it worked out, didn't it? Listen, James, word of advice. Stop trying to prove yourself. Just do the job. Dad, I took a necessary risk. Necessary means you have no other option. That wasn't necessary. And you know it. I don't want to talk during cutscenes. What was that about? What do you think? Same thing it's always about. Hey. You know it's just because he cares, right? Yeah, well, you know a hell of a lot more about him caring than I would. Okay, um, yeah, um, we're just gonna go inside. Come on, Dave. <laughs> that was a shitty thing to say. Yeah. yeah um, I'm sorry. The thing is, you two are more alike than either of you want to admit. Damn, I was gonna say something. <laughs> what? what? That's it? I thought the new satellite would automatically link to the old ones. It cannot find them. Without regular scheduling from telecommand, tracking accuracy degrades. <sighs> Thanks a lot, Iris. Your vocal sentiment does not match your words' literal meaning. Thus, you are not actually thanking Please stop me. talking. So, I still can't find the other Hammer of Dawn satellites. On the plus side, I accidentally invented an AI that understands sarcasm. Here, that data drive you wanted. Maybe it'll help. Find lost satellites? I doubt it. But I'll take a look. Wait, hang on. Did we do all that for nothing? Oh, it'll fire. But with only one working satellite up, it'll be tough to control the beam. Hammer of Dawn, let's go. Ah. Uh, What's wrong with Dave? Dave had a few problems. What kind of problems? Hmm. Uh, that kind. Oh, I know I'm gonna regret this. <sighs> Everyone, meet the new Jack. When the hell did you have time to build this? When did I have time to build this? This is what I do. I sit here making stuff you guys don't appreciate and inevitably break. Okay, so what's different about him? All new range of behaviors. Improved scanning, augmented combat and support modules. He's literally one of a kind. Mm -hmm. And... And he's... all yours. 
<laughs> now, if you'll excuse me, I have a bazillion 40-year-old satellites to find. Damon, there are only 15 missing satellites. Thank you, Iris. So this is or Jack? To add to your growing library. Okay, all right. Before we begin, Damon, the combat module you brilliantly designed is now ready. <laughs> My use of brilliantly was intended to be sarcastic. Did I succeed? That's like the, uh... Follow me. The SpongeBob uh, Plankton talking to his robot. I'll make Jack combat ready. Oh, I'm gonna take this. All right, let's see. What is this? It'll give Jack what I've been calling Flash. It blinds, stuns the enemy. Ooh. New ability found, Flash. Equipped an ability. Jack has one assault and one support ability equipped at a time. Open the Jack menu with the uh, that button. Highlight the ability you want to equip and press A. Okay. Um, flash. So he has flash. He oh. <clears throat> so he has upgrades too as well. Um, Jack regenerates health faster. Increases Jack's maximum health. Jack can survive, revive himself twice as fast. Uh, Jack can be sent to revive down squad mates. That's insane. Stealth. He remain cloaked while boosting. Jack can remain cloaked while carrying a weapon. I don't really think I care about him being cloaked. But that's good to know. Zapper. Uh, Jack can fire a zap for longer. Increases the zapper f uh, effective range. Zapper deals... The zapper damage increases the longer it hits an enemy. Zapper can hit, I thought it said kill. Can hit multiple enemies at once. That might be nice. Core. Jack's, Jack can fetch heavy weapons. Sharpshooter headshots kills. Uh, recharge Jack's uh, abilities faster. Executioner. Execution recharge Jack abilities faster. Kills recharging Jack's abilities slightly faster. Well, well, I'll be in lurk mode. Don't forget me, or they'll never find your body. Whoa, what? Well, I'll be in lurk mode. Don't forget me, or they'll, f or they might never find your body. Hey, Auburn, with those comments, I can never forget you, brother. Can't. D have fun with whatever you're doing. Hopefully, probably working out or something. <laughs> I'm trying to become a. a NFL prospect. I, I respect that. All right. Installed and equipped. So, how do we use it? I'll show you. Here's four or five. Over this here. is five. I have yet to. I don't even know. If, I think I played four. Because I remember her and stuff and her mother and stuff. So. Mark okay. three Lancer boot paint. Grab a weapon and get into cover. It then seems we'll to be to collaborative effort between Marcus and Beard. Baird. And, <laughs> Hey, CTZ and girl, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the brains, the zombie horde. Thank you for the love and support to my channel. I appreciate that. <laughs> oh, citizen. Oh, I'm sorry, citizen girl. Uh, citizen girl. <laughs> I'm so I'm I'm terrible. I use I butcher so many names. I'm so sorry. But welcome. Returning the favor. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. I have a goal. I'm trying to follow. I'm trying to follow or slash sub to five thousand Twitch streamers slash YouTube people. <laughs> it's, it's Americans always say CTZ. I, you ain't wrong. <laughs> you ain't wrong. That's the first thing I thought of. I didn't even think about citizen. <laughs> That's so nice. Thank you. Thank you. I just want to give. I want to. I want to be able to do this. So when I go offline, and I want, I can follow people. I can raid people and just make their days. That's it. Ooh, M bar. But I appreciate that. All right, let's get a gun. Let's get a gun. Ooh, should we? I want the M bar. Now, get into cover. And I want the lancer. I want the lancer ammo. And I want the embark ammo. Your 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 goal for December is a great one. Oh 
hope you have a great turn, a great turn out. <laughs> you guys are, you, you don't get into cover. I this is why I love my community, man. Everyone's just so nice and welcoming and just, it's just great. It's great. <laughs> All right, hold on. Let me do this. That's what we all do here, support each other. And this is what, and this is what I want my community to be. I, like I said, I want to, I obviously want to grow my brand and my community and stuff, but I also want people to grow with me. I want this to be a collaborative thing. I don't want to just m me get all the success. I want everybody to be successful. Why and I want to be able to help difficult. people who might already. need a boost or might just have a bad or is seeing what they're doing and they're not having a good turnout. And I just want to be able to give them support as much as I can because it makes their day. You know, yesterday was, made me smile so much when I got to raid uh, Brittany. And, th and now the fact that I can raid somebody else is going to make it's going to be an amazing feeling. I can't wait. <laughs> Yeah, I've I'm trying to reach 100 followers, raise 102 for St. Jude, for uh for a community campaign, Fallout for Hope. That's beautiful. That's a beautiful thing. Are That's a, such a beautiful thing because I want to do a stream. Uh, I'm a bit I'm a big advocate for people with disabilities, so I want to raise money. I'm gonna do I'm gonna plan it next year. I'm gonna do a fundraiser to raise money for people with autism, Down syndrome, like basic any. Uh, disability and give money towards them. I want to. I want. I want people. To, I want to bring more aware awareness to uh, these types of people. It's because it, you know that's what I do for a living. I work with kids and clients with disabilities, and I want this me streaming to get to more people so they know uh, about this. You're a positive streamer. I like your style already, so obviously, though, thank you. <laughs> Again, I'm just, just, I'm just honestly being myself. That's all I'm doing. Yeah, and I just, I, I don't. I guess w I don't want to say I have a good heart because what is actually good, you know, I, I do what I think is the right thing to do. You know, I want to show. Pe I want to be a positive and inspirational p person to people. I want people to see me and be like, that's that's something good to do, or that's a good idea, and just. Help as many people as we can. If if everybody in the world did something nice for for somebody other than themselves, we would be in a different position than we are now. Oh wow, you are doing amazing. So I say, love your name too. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> we and this is and this is the beginning. You know, I like the fact that I'm able to reach out to almost two thousand people. And this is just on Twitch. You know, I I want to be able to reach to as many people as I can before I die. It's just a fact. It's just how I feel, you know. I want to be. I want to put. I want to leave my impact, a positive impact on the world, and I want to touch as many people's hearts as I can. And I'm gonna do it. I don't care if it takes me years. Um, this is this is the beginning. This is the start. I'm gonna continue doing what I'm doing. And citizen girl, I wish you the best of luck in streaming. And if I if I am ever, ever streaming and I'm about to get off and I find you and you're on. You best believe I might drop by and give you a raid. You know, again, it's all about sharing and supporting people who support you too. So, say you got a target that seems uh. awfully comfortable behind cover. Jack's flash ability fixes that. Aim at the DB and activate. See what happens. I kind of want to use this Ember. Huh. Cool. Now Whoa. let's try it again with multiple targets. Iris, activate Alpha 332. Uh, Jack's got to reroute power between flashes. Once he's recharged, hit him again. Hold on, guys. Unlawful citizens identified. Uh, unit reloading. Shit. What did I do? Ooh. Nice work. <laughs> Feel free to thank run you. it again. Of course, of course. And I want to say thank you so much for taking the time to drop a follow. I appreciate that. 
you know it, it could be from something to just being here and just seeing me as a person and listening to anything I have to say to dropping a follow to to bits anything anything I'm so appreciative the number one thing is your time the the fact that I I am streaming and you guys are spending time with me while you're only having 24 hours in the whole day is amazing I can't believe I can grasp some of you guys attention and to your time so I'm thankful for that yeah let's do it again. oh I didn't want to do another test see I got distracted what game is this by the way it looks really good this is Gears 5 this is Gears 5 Um, I got it. If you have an Xbox, I'd say get, like the game pass is like two bucks, and you can it's, it's on there. Like all the gears, like gears one through five. Ooh, look at that! Ooh. Is that it? Come on, peek. That's so nice. <laughs> oh, and nice. Okay, I'm PS5. I could try it on my laptop, maybe. Yes, definitely. If you have your laptop and you, I don't even think you need a Xbox. I think you just need an account. You can get the Game Pass for that. There's a there's an app for it. I'm using. I have a PlayStation 4 and I have an Xbox One. So what I'm doing, I, I just get the Game Passes for both of them, and then I play them on my PC with the app. You have a PS5? I'm jealous. I'm jelly. I'm jelly. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> but now I need you to return your weapons to the weapons locker and get out of here. Are you trying to get rid of us? Oh, How is noticed. it, by the way? Anyway, you can boost Jack's abilities if you find the right components. Before you go see Jen, stop by the armory. They might have one you but even the PlayStation walk. Store, I mean the oh, we PlayStation Now, that. is amazing. Good. Like now being able to play to hundreds of games. What Damon means to say yeah, some of them outdated, but some of them are really good, and they add new games every Thank month. You, for th Iris. I think I spent ten dollars to be able to, but I use it for the value of being able to stream. You know, I could play so many different games, and it's been so helpful actually. Whoa, that smells. Oh, that shit does look good. Oh, less than great. Yeah. I know you were kind of mad. Hang on, that doesn't look terrible. How do you like it? Oh, I, I'm enjoying it. Yes, the yeah, that would be quiet. two bucks. You can't be two oh, bucks. Damon is not being truthful. Shortly before you arrive, PS5 is was awesome. I got, I got really lucky to secure one place. Playing places for is lightning fast too. Let's not get into specifics, Iris. Also, Ice Man, thank you for lurking. I detected genuine personal concerns. I I want to get one eventually, but I, the fact that I have a PlayStation thing. Well, the fact that I have a PC plays a big factor in that because I want to be able to I, whatever games that I want for those systems are mostly on PC. So I just chill and just play on here. <laughs> I'll be streaming Fallout 4 tomorrow. It's so fast on a PlayStation 5. But then we can't all be off on some. I, I can't wait to get one. Mission. I've seen I see a lot of people stream uh, stream with me? it and this is an army. Cutscenes are oh, instantaneously yeah, okay. like fast. Well, it's crazy. Look, we'll just leave you to the very important work. Do you, did you get the digital version or did you get the um the, con the disc version? Hang on a second, shit stick. Shit stick. Yeah, you can well, upgrade some graphic cards. Oh, That's no. I, so that I'm, I'm left like with the hard decision or, of should I used to stir up save my money to off. upgrade my graphics card or do I get the PlayStation 5? And I kind of want to just upgrade my Spar graphics card. Right and then I can just keep and going. Exactly is beating I can make my PC better than the PlayStation 5 at one yes. point. Oh, at no. some point. Uh, <laughs> while I can keep you upgrading it. So Pretty sure it's hard. What's actually being measured here is I'll see if I can hit you up tomorrow. Oh, nice. Uh, Offering. Oh, that's not. awesome. Thank Hilarious. you, guys. The Are distribution? Nice. Not? Oh, I'm in. Come on, man. Let's just grab a jack component and get out of here. No, this should be fun. Yeah, if, uh, um. How's that fun uh, working out for Citizen you? girl, what, are you, what time are you uh, streaming? Try it again, Tomorrow. Foss. Come on. Hey, here's the thing, Foss. The bottle's far with you, but not beat you. It's against their programming. But Thank you, Foss. See you tomorrow. Shit, false confidence. Quite a bit, actually. Want some advice, Phoenix? Nah, I'm good. 
Jin does love her golden boys. Depends. Gotcha, gotcha. Sure for very long. See that was Yeah, well, if you're on oh, and I'm on Twitch, I'll definitely oh, I'll watch you. I'll definitely time. watch you. Can we go find that component? I gotta clear my lounge. I hate having priorities before I have to do something like stream. <laughs> like today, I had to go pick up. Uh, I had to go do Christmas shopping, you, and Christmas I hate it. Mm. I hate going out. Chef actually, no, I'm not even. I, I actually do like going out, but when there's a lot of people, I don't want to go out. All right, where gotta go now? Borrow a component and upgrade Jack. Yes, I'll take it. Wait, why I gotta borrow it? Can I just take it? So once that's done, hopefully mid late afternoon. I'm UK though. Okay. Uh, what time would that be for me? Hold on. GMT hours. Okay, let me see. What time is it for you right now? It's two forty. It's two forty-five a.m. from here. Holy shit. Yeah. Okay. So late afternoon would be so nine. It's nine forty-six p.m. for me. <laughs> so for you I can't even figure that shit out I will figure it out I will figure it out <laughs> bro you four hours ahead almost five yeah I guess yeah Wait, oh it's, yeah it's nine five yeah five hours ahead no but behind right I'm five hours behind five hours yeah it's yeah it is five hours you guys are right Listen, I'm not good with numbers or math or any of that shit, so you gotta forgive me. <laughs> Alright, I could I could do that. I could figure that out. <laughs> See, it's not that hard. I got chat. See why why I gotta think too hard when I got these beautiful people who could give me the answer. <laughs> Low key, cause I I was I was thinking about it way differently. I prefer borrowing. Definitely. <laughs> You guys have so many time zones for real. It's hard to even keep up with just being in America. All right, let's see. So I can, oh, I can upgrade this version of Jack. Okay, so I kind of want to get to upgrading this because if he can have a tree. Oh, I got another achievement. I'll take it. I say, I'm loving the new Jack. Can't wait to test him out in the field. Try to contain your excitement. Poor Dave. I'm I like the name Dave more than Jack. Yeah. Even though it's generic. Had enough alone time with her by now. Where I gotta go? Report to First Minister Jin's well, office. Enough enough. Okay. Gotta see someone about these headaches. I will. I promise. After we talk to Jin. Oh. I saw something. Listen. Well, yeah. If it's 2:45 in your time. Please, please get some sleep. <laughs> and I should take that advice too, because I, uh, I'm, I'm a night owl, and I, I barely sleep. I get like, I stay up for like 19, 18, 19 hours in the whole day, maybe 20 sometimes. Let me be and do it clear. on a daily basis, and I'm, I know weapon, I'm struggling. I don't yeah. share your Yo, I went outside to see my dad chilling in a hot tub. I take one step, yes. and this well, motherfucker, New England weather, you almost killed me. The idea of the Yo, you know it's cold. You know it's cold when you start cursing. I <laughs> when you get in the car and you're like, "Fuck, bitch!" Like you just say, you just start saying random curse words because it's so fucking cold. Oh, you know you're a New Yorker. If you say, yo, it's cold as bricks, <laughs> that's that's some New York shit. <laughs> Massachusetts, baby. All right. I mean, hey, that's some that's that's some New England shit right there. When you go, when you when you walk in and you're like, oh, man, you bundle up and you will take one step outside. And you're like, what the? F yeah, I'm telling you, I hate I hate being up in up north. <laughs> New England is just not fun especially in the in the in the winter i think we just got a foot of snow <laughs> i'm telling you man there was a there was a there was um a skit or like it was maybe it was a tiktok or something or, or facebook video but this guy walked out and he's like oh and then somebody legit threw bricks and it's like oh oh and you know how it hurts like you know it's cold when it starts to hurt <laughs> But even now, even now, I have the heat on and I have a blanket. Yes, I'm a Jets fan, but 
told you, I'm like, I'm a New Yorker at heart. I have a New York's blanket. I have a New York Jets blanket. I got a, I got so much New York shit. <laughs> Do you know how, how fun football is in the snow? Oh my God. Actually, I don't like football in the snow. And the reason why is because I don't like of the streaming first. Thank you for the host. I appreciate that. You haven't felt that cold until you've been to England. I've been to Dublin. I've been to Dublin. And it, actually, it wasn't too, but I, I don't know if I went there in the winter or the fall. It was a couple of years ago. And that, the weather wasn't, it was actually not bad. It rained a lot. Oh my God. I've never seen so much rain in my life in a week. <laughs> I've actually in when I was in Dublin, Ireland, I lost my phone. And and this is why I love other countries cuz the way Americans do it is not this. So, uh, story time. <clears throat> I'm putting the controller down cuz this shit is is actually good. So, I went to uh Dublin cuz my best friend made it to the pro tour for Magic the Gathering, and so I went with him to go to the pro tour where he was playing for hundred like a hundred fifty thousand dollars or some shit like that hundred thousand i can't remember but we went to this cafe to get some food and everything like that i'm talking about when the winds were extremely windy raining it felt like a monsoon so my hand i had my phone in my pocket right so i kept putting my hand my and like the i was walking towards where the wind was so all this rain was hitting my face and shit so i had to keep taking my hands out of my pockets to wipe my face mistake biggest mistake right so when i get to the cafe i'm just chilling hanging out and everything like that and then i get up we we leave the cafe head back to our airbnb and i'm like uh where's my phone they're like did you leave at the cafe and i'm like bro i don't know i was like where's my phone can't believe it second mistake didn't put a case on my phone <laughs> so i'm freaking out it's pouring raining i run back to the cafe start asking people hey can you call my phone this is my number i've been getting i gave so many people randomly my number but this one guy his name is joseph was so cool he's like yo add me on facebook let's see if we can try to find your phone he tried we tried so many things he said hey you know do you have an, another technology you try to google and lock your phone so nobody gets any access to it these people helped me look for at least half an hour to an hour for my phone couldn't find it went back to the went back to the airbnb i'm so upset because like i can't i'm in a different country this is the first time i've been out of the country and i don't know where i'm at i don't know i didn't even like it's just it's just mine it's scary because you don't it you're on fair foreign territory so i call my mom tell her all this stuff she's like i can't believe you lost your phone yada 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 i go on google my phone it says my they locked my it says uh, I logged into Google because I had an Android, and it says I can call my phone from my my tablet. So I just started ringing that shit. Pow, pow, pow. Somebody picked up the phone. I swear you not. Somebody picked up the phone and, and picked up and said, hello? And I was like, oh, my God. Because I, I, we left the message on the phone. It's like, hey, if you find this phone, will you call this number, which was my best friend's number? So they call the phone. It's like, hey, yeah, we found the phone on the street, uh, on the sidewalk. I dropped it on the sidewalk halfway. I passed my phone like four times. <laughs> but it was so windy and so, like, it was raining so much that I, could, I couldn't, I wasn't looking down. I was looking for, because, again, I don't know where I'm at, so I was looking up. They found my phone and brought it to the police station. You know if you're in America, your shit is stolen. Especially if you're in New York, your, your phone is gone. I don't care what it, where you at, that shit is gone, probably being jailbroken and and sold off to somebody else. Gone. But no, they gave it to the police officers. The police officers, they said they're bringing it to the police station. So we told them, cool, we'll go to the police station. I'll go pick up my phone. The police came to my Airbnb and gave, hand, giving me, like, gave me my phone. And they was like, hey... Just to make sure the citizens go. Thank you so much for the raid. Every I appreciate that. <laughs> Thank you so much. Um, so when the police officer said, Hey, like, just can you just unlock your phone? I was like, Okay, boom, boom, boom. And I was like, Hey, my, my boy, can you call it? 
He's like, yeah, you know, you're pretty lucky, you know, if somebody just random. And I'm talking about like it was raining. Nobody was on the streets. I didn't, I didn't have my, my my phone was in the rain for three hours. <laughs> and let me tell you, that was the scariest thought. It's just like somebody having my access because your phone has all your information on it. Everything. They brought it back. They did all this stuff, you know, and we I wanted to thank the person, but they just dropped it off the PlayStation and they just gave me my phone back, which is crazy. <laughs> no, no, I, you're good, you're good. And then this is why number two is so important. Make sure you have a phone case because as soon as the cop gave me my my phone was cracked, like it wasn't bad. It was like maybe like one line. Then when I, I was so excited, I was like, yeah, yeah, I dropped it again on gra like cement, like like it had to been cement. I dropped it and I was like. Oh, it can't be that bad. I was like, oh my God. Because it landed on, like, face down when you, so I let the film landed like this, right? And I was like, all right, you know, I, I got my phone back. It can't be that bad. My phone was destroyed. <laughs> destroyed. <laughs> so I couldn't even use it. But the fact that somebody took the time to answer the phone, see that it, the message, call my friend, tell them that they're bringing it to the police station, that's just, the act of kindness was amazing. <laughs> I, hate, I hate the cold. <laughs> that shit hurt. That, that shit hurt. That shit hurt. <laughs> that shit is fun. Uh, the furthest I've ever been from Mass is Maine, El Mayo. Not much of a traveler. I've. That's the first time I've been out of the country. I, I traveled a lot for Magic the Gathering. I've been to Texas. I've been to... Florida, I've been to North Carolina, Maine. Maine is Maine is very sketchy for me, man. I ain't gonna cap that. Maine is weird. <laughs> and then I've been to Dublin. Like I've been, I want to go to. I want to be. To, I want to see what the West Coast is about. But until COVID is done, I can't. I'm not gonna be traveling no time soon. But damn, I got more to say about the stuff because I had my experiences in Dublin was is actually really crazy. <laughs> so, I'm 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 gonna explain more. Let me just fin let, let this play cutscene play. Because I gotta tell you, when I saw about Anya would have wanted you you don't get to talk more than a hundred to two hundred deers in one place, like, think, and then I gotta tell you about the guy I ran I into when I when we were trying to find a park. Like, I have stories. <laughs> I have stories. A program that gave you your son and mine. I honor Anya. I loved Anya. I don't care if you believe me. When my program was in its infancy, she came to me. She volunteered. Both oh, times I can't skip it. I want. I want to see. see I love the story so much. I have to just respect you know it and just how many stay in that alive today, thanks to her. She should be buried here, you know, with the All Fathers. The people need her inspiration. But more of the story. Your people from different countries that is not labeled wife. America are amazing people. Not, not I'm saying like not everybody, not everybody, but everyone I experienced from just Dublin was so nice. It made me Send contemplate like go like lose my train my plane ticket and staying. <laughs> ah, lieutenant. Like I want to, I want to be able to go, like go to Paris. I want to go to Australia. I want to go to, I want to go to Japan so bad. Explain when Damon Baird superseded me. Explain how launching a Hammer of Dawn satellite doesn't require my explicit approval. Same page, huh? <laughs> Lieutenant, the Hammer of Dawn has taken more cog lives than most of the armies we've opposed. Your father knows this as well as anyone. It's not the weapons I don't trust, First Minister. It's the people. Country stuff, but I'll never, I'll never go back. <laughs> Honestly, like Dublin was so dope. I would, I wouldn't mind living there. I wouldn't mind living there. The Getting my Dawn wife to agree to move to Ireland. That, that's a whole other story. Ah, that'll be a. And I don't know if I would stay there for the rest of my life. I would. I just want to experience a different way Why? of living. There's been activity in the nearby burial site. Chief Carmine, report. <laughs> British and Americans are so different but so similar. Please. It's mad. Slow I believe that. Down. I believe that. Mobilize the fourth division. 
We'll take command of the reinforcement effort. Do it. I'll country Go. shop swap. You so you would you would live in America? I swear that would be the, that. See, that would be so dope. Like I just had another streamer idea. What if I switched places with somebody in a different country and then we streamed our experiences there for like a week and then meet up to see that would be so sick <laughs> that would be so sick so okay so number two story so ubers i think they called it halo but ubers in in dublin were so expensive because gas didn't go by gallon like america it was by liter so it's like a gallon of gas is like ten ten dollars. So us in America's we're fucking bougie because we spoiled, bro. We spoiled us with a god. <laughs> um, but so we walked a lot, and I told you when I tell you I have never walked so much in my life. We walked over twenty miles more. We well we were there for a week, so we walked. I can't even I can't even tell you an estimated amount. We walked so many miles. I was in so good of a shape after that. <laughs> but we were like just chilling. We wanted to find a park. You know, apparently there was a park that was humongous and had beautiful infrastructure. So we wanted to try to find it. We we kept walking random because we had GPS. We weren't worried about getting lost. As long as we knew where our place was, we could always call Uber and just Uber back if if worse comes to worse. Um, so we, we found this place and it looked kind of like locked, but it wasn't. So we went into it and I'm telling you, I've seen, we seen a flock of deer and these deers are just chilling. You know, like deers usually run away from the sight of humans, but these deers didn't really care that we were there. And I'm talking about like, we got super close. And then my, my, my best friend was like, yo, Avery, why don't you go, go, go near the deer? And I was like, all right, all right. I was like, you know, I'm feeling like they, they like, they're okay. I got really close, and then one deer would look like the alpha deer, and I was, and he like trotted up towards me, and I was like, nah, nah. <laughs> Later to find out that park was called Deer Park. How funny is that shit? And the people actually took fruits and vegetables and came go to that park to feed the deer. We didn't know that. So we, th this was like a couple days later. So we ended up going back to that same park to try to find deer with all these carrots. No deers in sight. <laughs> um, the third story. The third story is my favorite story of all time. Eh, in Dublin. Yes. We are. So we're still looking for that park. And one guy, one gentleman with a dog and her and his son. Um, saw us that like we looked confused, you know. People can tell that we're not from there. It's so funny. I mean, the fact that I'm an African African American in Dublin, and again, I've only seen like maybe ten black people that in Dublin, so I stood out. <laughs> but he he stopped what he was doing, you know, hanging out. He's like, "Hey, are you guys lost?" Us as like we, us being from a different country, we don't take lightly of people just coming up to you and say hey guys are you lost because we don't know what your intentions are that's the that's the sad part but you know he came up with such a nice demeanor and was like yeah we're looking for a part like this thing do you know um he's like i can tell you how to get to these parks and we're like oh so dope so he him and his son is talking about like how great dublin is and all this stuff and he stops he like stone cold stops and looks at me and stops the conversation with everybody. And I'm like, why is he just looking at me? <laughs> uh, and he he actually looks at me and says, I'm so sorry. And this was in 2000, we're in 20. This had to been 2017. 2017 going into 18. I can't remember if it was in the beginning. It had to been, yeah, I think it's 2017. He goes, I'm so sorry. For what the police are doing to, I, I don't know if he said the words colored folk or, or I don't know, he, or black, like he said, he said, I don't remember what term he used, but I didn't take it as being racist or anything. Like I genuinely met, felt like he was being genuine about what he was saying. He was saying, I am so sorry for what the cops are doing to your, your, your people. And then he hugged me. I have never experienced so much compassion from a stranger. 
like that. And I cried because like it's just like it's so sad, man, that I get more compassion and sympathy and all this stuff from people from different countries than my own fucking country. You know what I get in America? I get and I'm a hard worker. I had a 2017 Mazda 3 uh, Torin, you know, and when it came in 2017. And when you know the shit I get is I pull up into a supermarket, I get out of my car, and a white gentleman sees me get out of my car and goes, "Nice car, do you steal? Did you steal it?" That, that that's the shit. Like they're the levels of competency. Like it just it just blows my mind. We're in a country. A stranger shows me love and compassion, and then. I get shit on him from, again, I'm not saying everybody does it. Again, I'm not saying that. I'm saying, like, just a few select people do. I just don't understand it. But that gentleman, I will never forget that day because it made, it made me feel loved, you know, in a way that I have never felt like that from a stranger. And he and then I looked and he and just seeing his eyes was that's what made me cry. But not even the hug, because he he truly meant the words he that were coming out of his mouth. And this is actually it had to been six and it had to be. Yeah, it was definitely 17 because Trump was president or was announced president. And we went and. Um, yeah, he was announced pre- that he was president and every person was asking, they weren't even interested in what was happening in their own country. They were so curious of how Americans are dealing with Trump, Donald Trump being our president. I have never been asked that question more than when I was in Dublin. You know, we would take an Uber and it's like, hey guys, how you doing? Oh, we're like, we're not from here, we're from America. Oh, how do you feel like... That Donald Trump is your president. I'm like, I've I've got so many times I've been asked that question, you know. But th- again, it's, and and that wasn't that was that time with that ge- old gentleman guy. It's just everybody else was just so friendly, you know. But from the guy Yosef who tried to help me find a phone from the person who found my phone and brought it to the police off the police station. From the police station, bringing my phone, a phone. They they have bigger, better things to do, but they took their time to bring me my phone. We don't. I you you can't say that shit. Have, I mean, I don't say it don't doesn't happen in America, but that shit is rare. That shit is so rare. I have gotten so so much compassion in that one week than I've ever had in in a straight day in America, and that's the sad part. That should be a universal thing. I'm sorry, I don't mean to go on a rant, but I didn't want to get this shit off my chest because this this is important to me. The compassion, the love, the second to do something other than for yourselves is what the whole world needs, especially the time what we're doing with right now. Right now, everybody is, oh, I'm I'm in here to get mines. I'm here to be my I'm here to do what is best for me. Fuck everybody else. No, that's not how it should be. We're we're species. We are all the same, but we are all different at the same time. But because you are different doesn't mean you should treat somebody in any different way. Because they're still a human being. Right now, we are going through a time we have never experienced in the pandemic. This is the time where instead of being divided and fighting against each other, we need to cut the bullshit and get together and be one and beat the pandemic. Come together. Oh my God, sorry. Come together and show kindness to others. And be there for your neighbors. Be there for your, your people that you don't know. Just because then... What's the... Uh, n- niceness and compassion and love is contagious. I feel like positive things are contagious. If you do something good and somebody like say you do something good for somebody, you might be doing you might make that person's day. And, you know, that person's day might or that mindset that person had earlier might have changed and make them want to do something nice. And you don't know what 
position people are in. You say something negative to somebody, they might do something unspeakable. You never know. Words are so powerful. But back to this, this is why I'm building my community. I want to build a community where we all can feel like ourselves, that you can feel safe to be who you are. Because at the end of the day, that's what you that's why you're on this planet. We our time is so limited to be here. Why why feel any negative negativities? Why feel negative about anything? This is a privilege to be alive. My community is all about building everybody up. And has and growing, do and telling people that you can do it. You can put whatever mindset you can be into. If you wanna if you wanna shoot for the stars, shoot for the stars and shoot higher. And I'm telling everybody in here that I will be by your, by your side 100,000% more than anybody that you know. Because I believe in you guys as you guys believe in me. And that's how it should be for every person. People make the impossible possible. You don't see those miracle stories because shit happens. People put in the hard work because they can. I've seen people, this guy on, on, um, on Snapchat who lost his arms and legs. In a motorcycle accident. And he's still one of the best gamers. Because he, he didn't want to give up. Yes, he had a lot of difficulties. But th the whole thing is we are always going to have adversity in our lives. It's just it's a fact. I'm going to I'm gonna get to all these comments in a second. But there's always going to be negative things in the world that's going to happen in our lives. But that shouldn't be. We shouldn't let that shit overcome or consume us we have to rise above all the bullshit and just try to live our lives the way we want to the fact that we have to work to to live is insane I, again i'm not gonna this is why i want to i want to become president <laughs> <I'm> just <kidding. laughs> but <laughs> i just i see i see the world for what it is and i see that all law are all hope is not lost. It's not about obviously this is going to take years for us to try to fix it. It's it's for us to set up the future for the younger generations. Cuz when we're dead, when when it's our time to go, that's it. We don't it's in their hands to continue loving the world and doing things the right way. We got to start from now. We got to start now. And slowly make a positive impact and show people this, that doing good, doing all this shit, loving others, doing things for others, you know, will benefit everyone in the long run. <sighs> Ravens fan, thank you for the lurk. Sorry, guys. I, I got really into that. <laughs> I got, I'm just, I'm very passionate how I speak. And I tell, and I do this every stream. <laughs> so far, it's been every stream. But this is who I am. I've never stopped being this person. You know, some people like even some of my friends, my first my one of my my best friends for many years thought, you know, the things that I was saying is just like I'm trying to put on a facade. And then she figured out like, holy shit, AV is legit because all he does is talk about this. And all I want to do is good for people. You know, I've always been like that. Because, I again, Acts of kindness is contagious. And if I can help somebody to help another person, it means I'm doing, I'm making an impact in people's life in a positive way and hopefully can shape other people to do more positive things. Again, I'm not trying to force people to do anything that they don't want to do. But I want to be a, I want to build who I am and my brand and be a positive influencer to kids and and bring awareness to disabilities for the people that don't have what we have. We are lucky to have 10 fingers, 10 toes, breathe fine, see sight, hearing, a house over our head, a car, a phone, family. Some people don't even have those stuff. I'm blessed to even breathe the next morning. You sure you ain't a preacher on weekends? No, man, no, I'm not a preacher. I just, I just believe in what I have to say. 
I, I'm a firm believer in the words that are coming out of my mouth. And I hope that I can make an impact in people's life. I hope I make an impact on your guys, you, everyone in my chat, in a positive way. I know a lot of people is preaching the positivity in their chats. I know people do that, you know, because it's just like, I actually I was watching um, Angry Pug with my wife, and he was saying, yeah, a lot of streamers are doing that positive, you know, I want to build a positive community. I want to build a, I'm not trying to do anything other, what other people are doing. I want to build a safe place where people can be themselves. I want to show people who, who the fuck I am, Avery. I, that's why I tell everybody, hi, my name is Avery, but I go by Suavecito. Suavecito is le the, per the, the thing that helps me come in front of you guys and explain who, who I am without feeling shy or it gives me the utmost confidence. And I, and, I, and I tell you guys, and I'm always thankful for you guys because 24 hours in a whole day ain't no fucking joke. That's all you have in a day. And you guys are taking... One second, 10 seconds, a minute, an hour, all that time to spend it with me. A person who starts out as a stranger. You guys are more than friends to me. You are my family. And as a family, I'm just trying to grow you, grow as and make a big ass family that loves each other and supports each other's and do it this way. I, and that's why I tell people I will be big. I will be one of the bigger streamers. But I will do it because I want to make impacts on so many people's lives. And this is a way I can do it. Social media is one of the biggest platforms. And this is how I want to do it. You know, I will be able to touch so many more hearts. I will be able to tell people my message before it's my day to die. I want my future kid. Again, I'm sorry that I I know you guys are typing in the chat. And I appreciate every, every comment. I'm going to read it. And then I'm going to get back into some, some gameplay. But I really want to get this this what i'm saying i want my future kid to a boy or girl whatever i have to see what i have done in the in the span of time that i've done this i want them to see all the videos all the hard work how i preach the the, the hard work of the perseverance the shit the bullshit i went through the ups and downs to show them my finished product that if you put your mind to whatever you believe in you can do it. And that's why and that's why I'm on a goal to do to follow 5000 people. Because every person deserves a chance. I've seen so many TikTok videos of somebody saying zero viewers and then they get the one view and it's in the streamer by. And then it's like they give up streaming. No fuck giving up. That's what People who want to see, that have bad intentions, want to see. They don't want to see people succeed. They want to see people n not make it. Don't, and it's not about proving people wrong. It's about proving it that to yourself that you can do things that you put your mindset to. Hold on. All right. <laughs> Let me, I got to, I got to catch up now. Uh... Americans are fucking assholes. There's a reason Massachusetts people are sometimes called massholes. Yeah, actually, uh, yeah, that is true. <laughs> people call people, Massachusetts people massholes. But not everybody in this world is bad, like, ha like are assholes. Uh, not all Americans are assholes. I, I'm an American. And I don't, again, I don't put myself on a pedestal. I don't put myself, I, I believe in that I'm trying to do good in my way. And people, some people have said I have. Motherfucker, motherfucker said <laughs> too far. It's be, it's because uh, motherfucker said uh, too far. It's because America is basically a fucking Family Guy episode to the rest of the world. The U.S. makes no sense. Honestly, the U.S. feels like a circus. It really does. So because like especially when I went to Dublin, man, because everybody didn't care what was going on in their own country. Everybody's eyes were on us. Uh, th that reminds me of when, uh, 
Prince, Princess Diana died at the at the time I'd flown out to Florida the same day she died. Lily spent the entire 22 weeks being asked, are you okay? Did you know her, et cetera, et cetera. The Florida peeps thought we must know her maybe because our country is so small. No, we we see the good things you are all doing. We know Trump and and the bad folk are a, min are a minority. You sure? Yeah, you sure you aren't a preacher on weekends? No, I that, I, I know I read that one, but that that's a funny comment. <laughs> I would love to hold segments where I get to talk to people. I would love to do that. I don't want to say I want to be a motivational speaker, but I would love to tell people what I believe in. <laughs> Never be sorry for speaking about how you you feel, you care, and and have compassion, and that is beautiful. Thank you, Citizen Girl. I appreciate that. I'm, I appreciate that you're still here. That and it's two forty five where you're at, maybe three o'clock at this point, and you are here. That there's actually an NFL player who was a starter for the Seahawks who only had one hand. Exactly, and I voted for him so hard. I'm that's a proud thirteen thirty seven. <laughs> hours i'm not doing that <laughs> yeah i remember him i also remember kaepernick who happened to him what happened to him was awful but his message uh, lives on and look at the nfl players now all it takes is one person to stand up for for all it takes is one person to be um the what's the word there's a specific word for it not not mar martyr to be the martyr, like the person that leads by example, because if you stand up against everything that you believe in, others will, people, others will, others will. Um, I'm a Rams fan, by the way. I am also a Rams fan. <laughs> the only British people who loves the NFL, <laughs> British per person who loves the NFL. Hey, I respect that. Yeah, yeah, you will, Avery. I'm supporting you. Thank you, Citizen Girl. I really appreciate that. You might get the Jaguars over there in England. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> Last game I saw in England was Rams versus Cards, and we smashed them 33-0. 13-3. 33 33-3, I think. 2017-2018 Super Bowl 53. <laughs> we, we always beat them Cards. <laughs> There's nothing you can do but root for him. He made it to the highest level with, with such a handicap. And that's what, and that's why I say the impossible is never. There's no. I don't believe in the word can't. That shouldn't be in people's vocabulary. Because if a person that has one arm can make it to the NFL, there's no excuse for anybody else. Or a person who can be one of the best gamers to have no arms or legs. Or there's a gamer that who's blind. A gamer who can who can't see the game, playing Mortal Kombat and whooping people's ass like that. Those stories are what makes me believe I could do anything. Like so, when I tell people I'm gonna be I'm gonna be sponsored by Steam one day, I'm gonna be one of the first streamers to be make it into space. I'm gonna be one of the streamers to facilitate one of the biggest dodgeball slash football slash sporting events for all types of streamers. I'm gonna be one of the biggest people to talk to thousands and thousands of people and give them the same message. One day at a time. I have all these goals, but I have to lay down the foundation. And I, I, when I, when I, and when I tell people I want to follow 5,000 people, it's not because I want to follow, like, I'm not asking people to follow me back. I'm just telling people I'm, I, I took the time to follow them. I always put followed because I want them to know, hey, I took the time to support you and I want you to know that you have my support. Like, no bullshit. <laughs> Hold on. Where is it? No. Oh, hold on. Where is my... Like, followed. 
followed, followed, followed because these people deserve a chance. They deserve a chance. And when I say like literally almost two that like I'm up to like almost two thousand to twenty five hundred people, I'm serious. I'm serious. I put so much hours into following show people, hey, I'm Avery. I checked out your channel. I and the thing is that that's important because I time is the number one most precious thing in people's lives. So the fact that I, you know, like I took a time, I want people to know I gave you my precious thing that means the most to me. To give it to show you that I I believe in you. I'm telling these people I believe in you. Don't give up in your dreams. Don't do it. Um, I know this. <laughs> Can you help me grow here? I want to be the biggest girl streamer. Absolutely. Absolutely. We could also do a collaboration. We could do, we can definitely do it. If, if that's your, if that's what you want to do, we get, I'll help you. I'll help you. And I'll tell, and that's why I'm telling everybody. That's why I'm doing the new year's Eve stream. I'm letting, I want to bring as many streamers on there and interview them, play among us and, sh and tell, have them tell them, tell all of our communities who they are. That I want to do that so I can, I want to, and I want to, I think I want to do it once a month, bring 10 different streamers, bring 10 different streamers, like a collection of 10, interview them, play games and just let other communities see who them, who they are to help them grow. Because then what we'll do is everybody will be like, or everybody would be live and all everybody's communities will be watching this one Zoom call. And everybody will get to tell everyone who they are. And and that's how you do it. That's how you show it's a it's a great way of discoverability to give people opportunities. I know this kid named uh, Kawake. He he is so fucking good. He just he just don't try and it pisses me off so much that all his talent is go uh is going to waste. Hold on, I uh oh, oh wait, wait, wait I'm 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 behind a little bit. Um in practice if I say I can't my ass running laps, my ass doing push ups, my ass getting chewed out. Because you because it's it's like giving up. Can't is not a fun word. It's it's like giving up. No, it's it's about persevering through the hard things. I know this. Oh, I hate so far. Yeah. So with your friend, man, like you can't force people to to change who they are, but you can try to be a positive influence for them and just always try to keep pushing them. You know, try to be there that support system for them. You know, and then it, again, at the end of the day, that person has to make the decision for themselves. But if I know I push my friends to be their greatest, no matter what. Um, the Twitch community are so much more supported than YouTube. I built up 112 subscribers over in a YouTube over a year and a bit. And honestly, the people I've met rarely subbed. Um, on Twitch, they're so so different. The majority supports each other. It's amazing. Yeah, let's collab. Absolutely. Hit me up. Hit me, uh, whisper me. Um, yeah, so... The only thing that it's the, the this oh my god, the, the the bad thing about Twitch is the discoverability. If you don't, have, it's the number the way to get discovered is having viewers, and that shit sucks. Like, they're trying to figure out different ways to do it, different algorithms. But if you're starting off, you're you're already on a handicap. It goes from highest viewer to lowest viewer. And that's and that it's not it's not fun. No, it's it's not. It makes it harder for people to get discovered. That's why I want to give when I when I say I want to host people, raid people. I want to give people a shot who just start off. Why not? This is this is how it should be. And if and I like I said, I never ask anybody to do anything back. But if somebody wants to do something out of the kindness of their hearts, that's appreciative. I always pay things back. 
a person gives me a follow, I want to give them a follow back. If somebody raids me, I want to raid the next person. I always, I always believe in paying things forward. And that's how the world should be. Somebody does something good, you do something good, you know. Or but don't do don't but don't do it because you feel like you have to feel, do it because you want to. There's a difference between having to or wanting to. Inside, you realize I'm the ranking officer here, right? And we'll reinforce Karma. Yeah, citizen girl, definitely whisper me, whisper me. Um, definitely figure some shit, some things to do in the future. I can't believe we're back here. We did our. I would love to have you a part of. You need uh, to get over it. Uh, the, the Zoom calls, Guys, the things time. I'm gonna do once a month with all different streamers. Cool, let's see what we're dealing that would with. be dope. And again, I, I started at the bottom, oh, and I'm proud shit. of my 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 grind. But now the fact that I'm doing the hard work and doing all this stuff, I'm gonna give back. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah, just 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 so I don't forget. Yeah, definitely whisper. Definitely whisper, man. I'll I'm gonna send you a link to my Discord where we are gonna discuss more of it. And and this is another reason why I love Twitch because I get to meet so many di and and Reddit. I stream on Reddit a lot because I get to meet so many people from different countries and see what their mindset is and see how they're dealing with things and see what like it's like me traveling the world. Guys, at 11.30 Eastern Standard Time on Sunday, me and my boy King Kato talk about the show. And let people from Reddit and Twitch be able to have an opportunity to call us and talk about literally anything. Literally one of my favorite segments. I look forward to Sundays, which I don't know if it's going to be. I don't know if it's going to be tough to my schedule. Is gonna be a little bit. You'd like me to go on out your Zoom call? Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. How are we doing? Damn, bro, that shit was so crazy. I had to put every put everything down and listen. E e like that message means a lot to me as well because, like, the fact that I can make I can, not even make have people be interested to what I'm preaching since you called me a preacher <laughs> all right all right guys gonna get some sleep have a good stream brother you'll all have a good night P Rav B Gaming thank you so much for being here again I hope you have a wonderful night and I appreciate you I appreciate you get a, get some sleep I wish I could stream a little earlier if that could, if I could do that, like, I feel like I, I stream so late, eight eight thirty. I might have to go like again. I, I'm gonna change my schedule. You were really, you were really interesting, been really engaged, and this and, but this is how I want. I mean, I want my Twitch to be like this. I want, I want to have more conversations and talk to people instead of i mean give me don't get me wrong i love playing the game i love gaming but this is why i love streaming because i get to have talk i get to do, my my wife thinks i talk too much you know I, I and i was like why not i think i have a good personality you know why not talk, do streaming like i can talk and tell people what's on my mind and they can react to that I Reddit has trained me so much for <laughs> my partner says I talk too much. Hey, but they do it out of love. <laughs> they definitely do it out of love. Man. That was the last one. But I love my wife so much because she listens to Get everything I have to say. Our first date, I talked her ear. Yeah. <laughs> we the best kind of people. Yeah, because we there's no there's never any. Uh, 
downtime or down where there's no ever any awkward silence because we always have something on our minds there. to say. Look, our Raven's down. I compare my mind online. to um, uh, no can do, kid. a four out. or like six okay. intersection highway that is trying to merge into one because I have so many thoughts that want to come out. On, and even what like I think when I when I'm playing a game and it's just like just I think th I do have some stutters or where like I'm like I'm not really sure what to say but then I'll just make some shit up I'll talk about the moon because I'd rather have engage I want to gauge instead of having people just like, oh, I like talking so <laughs> welcome to the pre sensing <laughs> the pat down what's up hey listen off brand it, it's it's who I am man <laughs> I love talking I love preaching but again I want everybody to know that whatever you put your mind to I support you a hundred percent and you can do it you can do whatever you put like whatever it is it doesn't matter actually should I put it in this oh I need more components never let anybody tell you you can't and that's why on TikTok I do the, I, I I take a lot of the things I say on Twitch and I post it on TikTok because I want to tell the world my message that's it but how are you doing pat down <laughs> and I don't care how long it takes me to do <laughs> hey yo bro I'm a guy who doesn't know how to shut the fuck up i I'd beat you in argument 10 out of 10 times. I'd highly doubt that. I feel like you might beat me 7 out of 10 times. <laughs> I think it might be even 5 and 5. <laughs> I I make some really valid... Arg I, I'm really good at arguing. I, actually, I don't argue. I'm good at discussing topics. So, hey, I'll take it on any challenge because... Win or lose, it's a learning experience. What am I supposed to do? Oh, am I supposed to like... Oh, I can take the enforcer? Now this will do. Ah, damn, should I, should I keep the shotgun? I think I should keep the shotgun. Damn, this is hard. Okay, I'll keep the shotgun. I'll keep the shotgun. No, are you supposed to go? Oh, right through here. Okay. After the boxing match, let's hold a conference where we both get a big boy seat, get the big boy seats, and just argue. I'm down. I might. I don't know if I'll be conscious to be able to have a conversation, but I'm down. Let's do it. <laughs> I'll, like I said, I'll never back down from the challenge. Through here. And I love competition because it makes me feel like I could. We got a on I, I love I love competing with the it because it allows me to work towards something. Right we're done here. So best believe when we do this boxing match, I'm gonna be working hard. I'm gonna be going to the gym. I'm gonna be having a hiring a coach. You name it. I'll put the hard work. Arguments of bot or boxing. Oh, we, we can't do both. <laughs> Kick your ass and hands and words. I like being the underdog, bro. <laughs> Arguments is a rubbish boxer. I'm a rubbish boxer. <laughs> we could totally do that. That's awesome, Citizen Girl. <laughs> I win fights with words all the time, though. Because words are powerful. Words are, I mean, listen, fighting is powerful because, like, how strong. But if you fight with your words, you can prevent a lot. You could do a lot of things. <laughs> we, maybe maybe that's I'm always this is why I love streaming too because I'm always having ideas I'm like what if I had a topic and had streamers come in or people come in in my chat and I zoom like a zoom call or anything and just be like okay this is the topic you're this is where do you stand in this and then have the two debate and then have the chat decide who wins it see like I'm having these dope ideas <laughs> I have a calm voice never raised uh I never raise my voice. It works wonders because I, I I love that the fact that you do that because that's how it should be. Raising your voice doesn't really get you. I feel like you can have more of an impact if you talk in a calm, 
intelligent way. You know, people who take their time to speak to people shows more confidence and they are processing thoughts of what they want to say next. It just honestly, it also it ticks people off when when they're heated and you talk like this. It's like, hey, listen, I'm sorry that you're mad. Like that shit bothers them so much. I have been I've dealt with somebody who is like really like physically wanted to fight me. I'm like, listen, man, I don't got time to be having a fight with you. But if you want to talk about this, we can talk about it. And they got them matter. <laughs> like, I don't get it. They people don't like that. You don't meet match their level of anger. I just don't believe in being angry. But don't get me to that point when I'm angry because then I'm like the hawk. <laughs> I just kind of yell a lot. So a rebuttal and he was awesome. <laughs> Alfred, I, I, I could see that being your person. You have you have a really dope personality, by the way. <laughs> you know what I said about the smallest dog having the loudest, loudest bark? Yeah, I agree. Like, because you, because you, because a person who's yelling doesn't mean you you have what it takes. <sighs> Having sorry, <laughs> I keep skipping letters. No, you get P.S. I never fight, like argue, I debate though. I don't do angry. You guys are funny. <laughs> I am a believer of. I don't believe in arguments. I don't. I believe things can be debated or discussed. You know, I, I told my wife I, I don't have. A, she, does, she never understands why I don't get mad or like meets her, meets her level of uh, anger or like, intensity. It's just like, I don't have time for that. What is that? What is me being angry going to do? It's just going to, it's just going to either make the situation worse or it's not going to solve anything. I'd rather keep a cool, head, like cool head on anything I do. Lizzie, Delta here. There's a swarmack in the settlement. Keep your convoy the, away from especially it. Especially in, like, times of crisis, man. That's the people you want. Not, not a, somebody who's hot-headed. You want somebody who's going to be calm and collected and process the situation to the best of their abilities. A la your boy, so obviously, though. <laughs> I need an answer. You got biscuits on your website instead of cookies. You sound like my my American equivalent for real. <laughs> I hope you're spelling. I hope I'm spelling your name right. No, you are. That that is that's exactly how to spell it. Avery. A V E R Y. You have cookies, of course. Ah, uh, see, nice. Citizen, what do you what do you stream? If you don't mind me asking. Biscuit, biscuits with my tea. <laughs> I would actually, I would like. We both do have similar mindsets. I would love to have a conversation with you. I feel like that would be a, an awesome stream to do. That's why I want to do the Zoom Eat shit. Like the first, yeah. The first Lizzie's Zoom call is gonna be it. New Year's Eve. Yeah. So I'm it's trying old. to see. Again, it's hard to do figure out with everybody in different time zones, but I'm trying to figure out something that works for everyone. Biscuits over here are lighters. Biscuits over here are lighters. Not really because. They... <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah. uh... Come on, let's cut through this building. Everybody, stay back! They're coming in! Hey, stand down, Private! We're geared! Oh, shit, sorry, Lieutenant! So, no I'm harm, probably gonna be streaming for. What are you doing here? I lost another our DB, so we got civilians holding up to the Lizzie, two and a half Delta hour, three hour mark. And then I'm gonna raid somebody. Complex. Copy that, Delta. I'll circle back. Thanks for that, Lieutenant. No problem, Private. Come on, Delta. Alright, wait, I gotta check over here real quick. Sorry Ooh. again for the air and fire, Lieutenant. I'm glad you showed up when you did, sir. Alright, nothing over here, nothing over there. Uh, at the moment, I've been streaming Fallout 4, Call of Duty, Modern Warfare, and Block Ups. I was gonna stream Cyberpunk, but waiting for them to fix the game. I'm also doing the same thing, because Cyberpunk is... I bought it on Steam, and I'm forced to keep it. I'm going to be streaming something different though, teaching peeps how to create overlays, widgets, logos, etc. 
do you have a TikTok? TikTok is a really good way to do that stuff too. Like if you're gonna be streaming that st type of stuff, do TikTok because a lot of people are looking for advice into how like doing the overlays, the widgets, logos, all that stuff. And you would get and you would base your a lot of people from TikTok. You can be like, hey, listen, I'm going live to explain this stuff in person. TikTok is really big on that. I've seen a lot of people blow up because of their, like explaining how to do certain things. You guys here to pick us up? We're not, but the convoy's on the way. Wait, you can't use TikTok? No, we were told not to. No, we were told not to use TikTok because of the data breach, breach issues. I know they were having data uh, issues. I know the U.S. wanted to ban TikTok, but it's one of the most popular. It, it, gives, it allows people to get, like, the discoverability of it is, mine is with all the issues that it has. It's crazy. You never know what goes viral. And a lot, I feel like a lot of people are using it. Uh, uh, yeah, we can use it, but it, it, but here, but there are major data flaws. Uh, we, we're going to talk about how America spreads, spends more on military than China, India, Russia, Saudi Arabia, France, Britain, Germany, Japan, South Korea, and Brazil. The facts amaze me. Didn't they name the, what was the name of the soldiers that they're going to say they sent to space? Is it, did they call them guardians or angels or some shit like that? Yeah, I think the government announced what they were called. <laughs> they can literally see your messages and photos. I don't like that. No, I respect that. I respect that. Um, yeah, I guess that is an issue. I don't know. I, I just, I want to, I want to capitalize on it. And I guess if my shit gets leaked, I guess you guys are gonna see some really undaunting photos of myself. <laughs> But no, off-brand, for real, like, like we've been the U.S. is very big on the military, which is crazy. A lot of that money could be used in other resources, but I'm not president yet. But when I become president of the United States in 2032 or 2036, I'll be changing things. Maybe even later. Maybe, maybe we'll say 20, 20, 40. 20, wait, I'm 26 now? Uh, I think you have to be like 36 to be president, so 2020, 20, 12 years, maybe like 20 years, 20, 25 years. Yeah, TikTok terms and conditions are iffy as hell. They access and everything. I'm not easily scared away. I'm a techie, but for real, TikTok isn't good. So I shouldn't have TikTok. I got to be 35. Oh, okay, so I'm 26, eh, nine years. Okay. Well, I, I'll, I'll, be, I'll, I'll try to be president in like 15, 20 years. DBs, we gotta secure this straight. Yo, the fact that the way she sticked that bomb on him, that shit was ill. You are crazy! What can we do to help? Just clear this straight, Delta. Otherwise, we're stuck here. All right, you uh, heard burner it. and a board. VPN. I don't have any of that stuff, so I might be deleting my TikTok. <laughs> my TikTok. Nah, we're assisting I'm just, I don't know. We might need reinforcements here. Roger that, Delta. Your way I don't now. trust Phoenix TikTok, for the last but I was, I, I, I'm yeah. the ranking officer, which means so I, I call in the reinforcements. I, same, I don't yes, trust sir. any platform, I, I fix it. but I kind of need to use it. Again, if it's another platform where I can tell people what I'm about and what I'm what I'm trying to accomplish and just get my views out there, then I'm gonna I'm gonna use it. There's always gonna be negatives and positives with a lot of things. Again, I was I was skeptical of using TikTok in the last when it first came out. I didn't even care for it. Because everybody was talking about it. But now I'm like, okay, I can this can help me grow my channel and and try to accomplish my mission. I'll use it. Will I use it forever? Probably not. Uh, oh, that was a great grenade talk. Oh, 
Oh yes, what kind of? Sniper, take him out. Let's beat him up. Ah. JD, your condor's Yo. Low. What do you need? Oh, Fred, am I gonna do this in a boxing match? <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. Hey, give, me, give me a try. Oh, do I then? <laughs> Is it safe for me to come out of Loki? Absolutely, Tyan. It's up to you. They have your data already and will share it. But yeah, get a VPN when you use it. It doesn't matter what email you use, they, act, they access your actual device, so we'll still access your emails and messages and photos, etc. Google it. Sometimes if you want to WNA no more, it's crazy. Uh, hopefully they've cleaned their act up and secured data, stopped accessing devices. I think the fact that America was trying to ban it, maybe that will hopefully help them clean. I mean, I don't know. It's Anyway, I'm a... I'm GNS. Stop talking. Watch the game as I'm really enjoying this Gears 5 gameplay. Most of it's been me talking. <laughs> it's honestly been me mostly talking. I hope that's okay with everyone. <laughs> Oh, look at that grenade. Oh, oh, oh. I gotta stand up my ass. Oh, oh god. Oh god. <laughs> Guys, for Christmas, <laughs> if y'all want to support your boy, can I get like a, a, a nice a, like ass pillow? Like, I have this one. This one's like not great. <laughs> like I got a chair, a gaming chair that um vibrates, which I probably should use, but it takes so much things from my computer. I don't know. No, it actually doesn't. It just takes up a slot for my USB cord. And I'm just doing this cuz like my 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 ass hurts. <laughs> <laughs> this is why streaming for long periods of time is actually bad. It can create so many issues. Get Papa numb. <laughs> oh shit, this guy is no joke, huh? I got something for you. Hold this for Hit him with the oh, this thing is literally a tank. Just, I have a grenade. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Uh, Shepard, do not disturb me. That's it. The fact that I, the funny thing is, the fact that I talk so fucking much is <laughs> means I'm. It's gonna take me a while to beat games, which is good because I pause the game way too much. <laughs> Ooh, the M bar. I don't want the M bar. I'm gonna put this to six. I can't do six. I had more, maybe. Huh. Hey, the street's clear, but the roof tab ain't. We got a pouncer. Grab the gun and watch those quills. Oh, 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 Damn, these things are. Sick. This 
reason I love gears is the, the creatures that you put in the game. Maybe we, we can grab something to... I think there was a boom down there. I'm gonna grab it. Where's the boom shot? I think it's over here. Yeah, whatever the fuck this is. Stay back. Oh shit, get off me, get off me! Whoa, don't get too close! That's right. That's it, we're clear. Okay, thank you very much. Hey, ta taking time in game, it, it, uh, you're... Uh, hey, taking time in games is way better, actually. This is just my opinion, especially with a city or campaign driven Lizzie, games. You good to go here? I agree, I agree. Because yeah, then you enjoy the game so much more. Delta, Carmine squad, I mean, the, there's They're games that I've been rushing and it's just like. I regret it because it, then I don't have anything else to play. <laughs> yeah. They need you at the hub. Go! You can get there through the park. Gates by the steps. Alright, you heard her. Let's move. The cock symbols. But yeah, I want to get a nice uh, pillow. I, I want to get a new table, a desk for my gaming. And I want to get uh, a new pillow. And I want to get... I just want to keep upgrading my shit. Boy, Del. You're going to be okay. You know, you might not have a problem with shooting innocent people, but I do. Innocent, huh? Innocent. So people frame firebombs are innocent. Hm. Good to know. Both of you, knock it off. Wait, Titan, thank you for following Citizen this. Girl. That was you three? Not three. This is one Again, of us managed to keep This is why my chat is control. amazing. It's one of a kind. I don't care what other people say. This is my one of a kind no, community. You open fire on a protest. Every herd needs a good culling. I know who I call from this herd. How about Fallout 4? Yeah, Fallout 4 is an amazing game. I actually, I, I'm, I'm curious. To, I, I want to see you. Right now we focus on I definitely want to see you streaming. Um, the uh, um the information the like informing people with with uh the overlays and stuff i think that's really interesting and cool there's the hub dead ahead shit carmine is definitely in trouble all right let's go save some carmines uh, man how many times car they killed carmine and then saved carmine in this fucking game absolutely Damn ridiculous. it, Swarm's taking down our condors too yeah, I bet that goddamn swarm ain't brought it down. Every condo wins means fewer rings. Lieutenant, you are the king. Ooh, should I? Oh, we need to further order. Got a way through here. Shit, snatch it. That thing makes its way to the hub. Carmine's problem is gonna get a lot more. Mm -hmm. Come on. Fallout 4 is, is amazing. Fallout 3 definitely is great. And Fallout 4 is definitely out. added towards that overkill. Uh. What's up, Overkill? I've got one thing to say. These Papa things got to go. Oh, this is it. I don't see anything. Uh, I've literally 
just started playing it from the beginning. I played once once Wednesday, so I'm really I'm really early into it. I've been playing against Sunday. I've been, oh my god, I can't read right now. I'll be playing again Sunday or Monday, so welcome to join or watch recap later. I'll be venturing to Diamond City at the at the moment. I just discovered Sanctuary. Nice, nice. I actually played so much of Fallout 4. It's it's awesome. And yeah, uh, four years ago, but then didn't have a clue what was I doing, so never committed to continue. So it feels like the first time. I love playing games for the first time. It's just just feeling like new mechanics and all that stuff. I think that's why new games get the most hype because like it's things that we hopefully never experienced before. I'm actually going to stop here. I've been streaming for about two and a half hours. The reason why it's 11 p.m. for me and I want to raid somebody and also spend an hour on Reddit. You know, I like to stream on both platforms until eventually I have an. Um, I mean, I want to bring everybody to Twitch. You know, so I can just mainly stream on Twitch, but I want to be, I want to give love to both platforms. So I'm going to totally do that. Uh, does each Fallout game have its own campaign or does it follow uh, each Fallout feed off of each other? Um, some of them do. F I, I would say some of them do feel it feed off each other. Some are just individual, like Fallout New Vegas is just its own original f content. 